Hey everyone, it's Ben Jamin. Welcome back to my channel. And today we are gonna do my November plan with me. Um, this is crazy that I'm already like I've already done this for like almost um, four months. I know, like it's crazy. But anyways, um, this is really really exciting for me. This is a new stage of life in my YouTube channel. But in terms of bullet journaling, I did do some watercoloring and I did have to switch over to a different device because, um, or a different camera, like the one I'm using now, because <laughs> the first one that I was using got that storage. So you might see like a bit, of, a little bit of a jump there. But anyways, I hope you enjoy and let's get on with it. Okay, so I tr so to start off, I did. I'm using this watercolor later in the thing, by the way. But I wanted to make it like orangey, red, and brown to fit to match my my theme that you'll see me explain in like a few seconds. But um, yeah, so that's really it for like the watercolor part. But you'll see me incorporate it near the end. Okay, so I'm doing donuts. Are you guys excited? Because I am very excited because everybody loves donuts. But I'm not doing, I'm not making them colorful. I'm making them more like a brownish, you know, you know. So, yeah, I'm making them more brown. But I actually kind of want them to be brown because they're like they're cozy up with like a, with a coffee or, um, or hot chocolate and a donut and it's just like that fall brown color scheme you know I'm using my artist loft um, dual brush pens my um, my Crayola super tips and um, my brown Tombow Fudenosuke to make this work I'm also drawing a bunch of like circle donuts square donuts and donut holes just because they're they're all different shapes of donuts now the quote page says donut give up which i think is hilarious because um i actually i actually just was like so bored i didn't want to come up with my own quote because i knew it'd be super cheesy um so i came up with donut give up and i just searched it on google but i really really liked it because it's just it's so funny um but anyways um i'm draw i love how the donut is the word donut is in a donut if you can see that really well you probably can't but that's okay and then up i also really like how it's like a big bold lettering and give is just a simple cursive i'm also outlining them um, to kind of give it that hand-drawn feel and also kind of make it look like it is. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, now, here, I'm arrived at my calendar spread. I haven't done this in since July, which you haven't even seen me do. So, um, yeah. I, yeah. I haven't done one of these since July, and October was really stressful. But this is going to be more like for... Um, YouTube um, like I needed it to be because October I just it just got so crazy and I just wanted a place to dive on all my thoughts but anyways yeah that's what I did and you see me go back in and start outlining everything and yeah I also have a part for video ideas in my YouTube growth tracker and yes, some footage did get deleted, so, or it just didn't make it work for what I was doing while I was editing. But anyways, here I, here I am doing my, my trackers for the spread, and we're almost done. Yes, and that was like a pretty big jump from camera to camera. I just switched it because my, um, and this, door, this video is very against 
storage. Here's my habit tracker and mood tracker. These are pretty just straightforward, but my habit tracker is more like actually filling in the habits. And my mood tracker is kind of like my one for September, as in like filling in the coffee. And I also included a little latte at the bottom because I wanted a little tribute to my September 2020 um, so. Okay, so this is my playlist and it's just Harry Styles and Dua Lipa because those are the vibes. Um, and as you can see, the, the last one, I accidentally wrote the song title, um, with the wrong person, so I'm like, gonna go and fix that. But anyways, and then this is my Zentangle page. I haven't done, I've done a lot of these, but not on camera before, and it's actually really fun. And the quote in the middle says, try everything even though you can fail, from Zootopia. Um, and then this is my first weekly spread for November. And as you can see, I'm using the watercolor I did, and it's just pretty straightforward. It's Dutch door. It's really fun. So here's the flip through, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I just hope, um, yeah, I just hope you enjoyed this video and had a great time. Okay, guys, I hope you liked this video. Remember to like, subscribe, and have a great day. And I hope that your November 20, 2020 bullet journal setups did as well if you have a bullet journal. Thanks. Bye.